The energy value chain is being transformed today. The key driver for that transformation is the integration of renewable energies into, into the grid. Renewable energies include electricity from sun, from wind. And so basically we're going from a grid with centralized supply coming from power plants to a grid where anyone can actually start injecting power into the grid. So highly distributed and highly stochastic supply coming from renewable energies. So the problem now is the stability of the grid. And the key thing here is how do you balance out supply and demand? It means also that we need new forecasting algorithms. So instead of having to predict 48 hours or 24 hours in advance, we probably need to understand what's going to happen 10 minutes from now, such that grid operators can take the right decision. Does he need to restructure his network uh, or does he incentivize customers such that they change their behavior in terms of electricity consumption? At IBM Research Island, we're putting a team of highly specialized researchers in data mining, machine learning, in optimization, and we're working together with domain experts uh, from the industry or from universities to address these very challenging problems. Renewable energies play a key role to cover our future energy demand. The potential is huge. Ireland could reach a penetration of wind energy of almost 50% at times. However, integrating renewables into the grid is far from being trivial. Most renewable energy sources are stochastic by their nature. Production of renewable energy is often highly distributed, making it challenging to use existing infrastructure designed for centralized energy generation and distribution. ESB Networks is the distribution operator and asset owner for the Republic of Ireland and we're also owner of the, the transmission networks. What we're doing with IBM Research Ireland is we're looking at how we're going to manage data in the future electricity business. So basically what we're looking at is all the data that's going to be collected from smart meters in Ireland. Say for example we'll have 2,200 smart meters deployed to individual customers. We'll have 13,000 measurements on the network. And we have to look at how we'll be able to manage all that data to actually make it useful and make it intelligible for optimum management of the distribution system and of the, the distribution network. And IBM Research Ireland, working with ourselves and working with the real data in a real electricity business will be able to come forth with breakthroughs that will actually be a deliverable product for deployment across the world. Over 40% of energy used on the grid today is consumed by the commercial building space. So you can see how the building's consumption of energy can have a significant impact on how the grid performs. So the smart building research effort targets the significant energy users within commercial buildings. Uh, but research tools are being developed that will help the energy consultants to quickly pinpoint the relevant assets. And not only will you achieve obvious energy savings by being more energy efficient, but most importantly by having the ability to control and actively change a building energy demand profile in real time, you can achieve energy cost savings. HVAC is probably the most significant energy user within any building. So targeting research effort at establishing deeper understanding of how energy is used in this environment will lead to significant energy saving. Well, what Gia and Aspect found was that IBM's analytic capabilities and ability to capture and use air domain expertise to validate the operation of air equipment was an extremely powerful tool. This, in time, I have no doubt, will lead to achieving a fully optimised solution.